Hey guys, this is my Kershaw Knives Collection. First we got the Black Scallion. And we have the skyline. Then the storm, the uh, plain edge one. And then the serrated. Um, and then I have the Storm 2, the smaller one, plain edge. See how much smaller it is there. Next we have the Rescue Blur. Partially serrated, round tip, it's dull, and then the carbide glass breaker. Then we have the Tonto Blur, um, this blade actually came with a black handle and I switched it out with another blur and gave that one away to somebody else I have the whirlwind The speed bump, my clip here because this is this handles plastic. The clip here got caught on something, and the screw broke the plastic. So now my clip is loose, and I can't do anything about it because you'll tighten it, but it still moves because. The little plastic hole's broken. So I got a second one and modified the clip so that it was rounded on the edge and wouldn't catch on stuff. But it still caught on something. Same problem. Which is unfortunate because I really like this knife. Next, we have the leak. Every Kershaw fan is well aware of this knife. I got the partially serrated one because that's all they had at the store I was at, and that was before I started ordering knives online. Um, but I'm going to get one of the plain edge ones and probably even start a collection of just leaks because I really like this knife. Next we have the Baby Boa. Tiny little guy. Completely disappears in my hand. Uh, looked way bigger online. I knew it was going to be small because I read the specs on it but didn't picture it being this small. Um, yeah, that's my two fingers on the blade. Tiny little blade. 
you can get three fingers on the handle. I just basically keep this knife because it looks cool. Next, we have the Junkyard Dog. That was a fail. <laughs> Nice little knife. One of my favorites. Next we have the Cyclone. Plain edge. Big knife. And then I have another cyclone with the black handle, I mean the black blade, and partially serrated. I have the little dial on here, whoops, where you can turn the speed safe off. Or turn it back on. It's really neat. And then we have the pack rat, which is become my pretty much everyday carry. I'll switch out every once in a while with something else, but I mostly always just carry this one. Nice little knife. Opens very fast. I think probably the only one here that's faster than it is probably that scallion or maybe the boa because it's so small. And then my more expensive knives. This is the offset, Kershaw offset, um, handle, if anyone knows zero tolerance knives, this looks very much like a zero tolerance, um, G10 scales, monster of a knife, it's like the speed bump on steroids, um, also has a thumb stud, lock. Uh, this one is the Mini Cyclone uh, Thai ZDP. This was a limited edition knife. Uh, comes with a ZDP 189 blade and titanium handle little brother to this knife um, nice little knife this thing kinda don't know if you can hear that it rattles just a little bit it's kind of annoying but cool knife And then the Junkyard Dog 2 SG2 composite blade with the Super Gold 2 cutting edge and 410 spine and then titanium handles. This was also a limited run, limited edition knife. They only made a thousand of these and I was lucky enough to get one. So there's my collection guys. I uh, hope you like it. Stay tuned. I'm going to be doing more in-depth reviews of a few of these knives. Till next time. Bye.